Hey, 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 traders. Welcome back to Trade Pro FX, where we unlock the secrets of the market and show you how to make your trade smarter, not harder. Before we jump in, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're new here and ring that bell for notifications so you can catch every trading tip as soon as it drops. Now, let's talk a bit about deriv trading. If you've been with us for a while, you already know that Deriv is an amazing platform for online trading. It's user-friendly, packed with features, and offers access to all sorts of markets, whether it's Forex indices or our favorite, the synthetic indices like the volatility indices. One of the things that sets Deriv apart is how customizable the trading experience is, especially on Deriv Trader. You can adjust your settings, analyze charts, and most importantly, Use those sneaky little tools that give you an edge, like the changing cursors we're going to explore today. Before we dive into today's strategy, let me give you some quick advice, especially for my fellow traders who are just starting out. First and foremost, trading isn't a race. You're not trying to catch every single movement in the market, and you're definitely not trying to become a millionaire overnight. Discipline is your best friend, and that's something you'll hear me say a lot. At this point, I am pointing that's what we will focus. That cursor, which is keeping changing to... So put that in mind as we proceed, and also keep an eye of how it is behaving. Trading can be exciting. It can feel like a fast-paced game sometimes, but don't let your emotions get the best of you. Whether you're trading rise and fall, ticks, or candles, you need to have a strategy, follow it, and most importantly, stay calm when things get shaky. It's just like trying to cook the perfect steak. If you get too anxious and keep flipping it too early, you'll end up with a disaster. So be patient, watch the market, and wait for the right moment. All right, enough philosophy for now. I know you're all here for the juice. So let's get into this exciting rise and fall strategy using those clever little cursors on Deriv Trader. So today's strategy is about mastering timing and speed. And the secret weapon we're using is the changing cursors that sit right at the top of the Deriv Trader platform. You probably noticed them. They flash between green and red, depending on whether the market is rising or falling at that moment. Here's the basic idea. When you see the cursor turn green three times, it means the market is on a rise, right? But instead of jumping on the rise train, you're going to do the opposite. You're going to hit fall. Why? Because after three consecutive greens, the market tends to correct itself and fall. It's kind of like when you eat too many cookies at once. Eventually, you'll crash. The market's the same way. After three ups, it needs to come down for a breather. Okay, let's take a closer look. You're watching those cursors like a hawk. You see green flash once. You see it again. Then boom, the third green. That's your cue. But instead of hitting rise, you're going to tap fall. Why? Because after three greens, the market is usually ready for a dip. You'll be placing your one tick trade, which means this is fast. And when it drops, you've just bagged yourself a win. The same logic applies when you see red. Three reds in a row, you hit rise. Because after a small dip, the market likes to bounce back. It's a bit like when your friend tells a bad joke three times. You're bound to laugh out of pity at some point, right? The market's the same. After three falls, it usually bounces up. I have also decided to put the U.S. flag so that the accounts seem real, so that all those who rush into being tricked with real accounts can see also demo accounts can be used as real. Haha. <laughs> Anyways, I think you can see we are making good wins with the strategy. It's as simple as that. But here's the kicker. It's not enough to just watch the cursor. You need speed and a solid internet connection to get those trades in at the right time. Don't enter too early or too late, because trust me, the market won't wait for you. Now, I know what you're thinking. This sounds almost too easy, right? Well, there's a reason why I said it's almost a sure thing. This strategy requires you to be quick, like super quick. You know how sometimes you're trying to grab the last slice of pizza at a party, but someone beats you to it because you hesitated for just a second? Yeah, that's what this is like. Timing is everything. You've got to make sure you're hitting that fall or rise button the moment you see the cursor flash three times. Just remember, it's all about catching those three consecutive cursors. Three greens, 
hit fall, three reds, hit rise, get out there, give it a try, and let me know in the comments how it works for you. If you've got any questions, drop them below, and I'll be happy to help out. Don't forget to subscribe for more killer trading strategies, and hit that like button if you found this video useful. And let's get that money.